Hey, uh, this is Jimmy with Cascade Components. Uh, we've got here the uh, Santa Cruz Heckler with our brand new long shot kit on it. Uh, this will be hitting our website soon. So, similar to our Turbo Levo long shot kit, what we're doing on this bike is bumping the shock size up from a 210 by 55 to a 230 by 65. Uh, Along with that, there are you know, kinematic changes that occur. So travel goes up to 160, um, and then it's, uh, it's significantly more progressive than it is with the stock link, so super well suited to coil shocks. Um, the big, big thing we're going for with these long shot kits is just getting average leverage ratio down. Um, you know, their e-bikes with the battery and the motor and all are heavy to begin with. Um, and especially for riders on the upper end of the weight range, this can you know lead to, to challenges with tuning, maxing out you know spring rate, shock pressure, and whatnot. So being able to drop the average leverage ratio by about 10% goes a long ways in, in letting people get their bikes set up, um, you know, just the way they want it. Um, you know, putting people more in a usable range for shock pressure and spring rate, um, especially when you know they're they're pushing the uh, the upper limits of what can be done uh, with the stock setup. So, yeah, we're uh, we're really excited to get this one out there. Uh, we think for for riders that like large volume air shocks and coil shocks, this will be an excellent pairing. Um, it is designed to keep geometry pretty similar to stock. Uh, this particular iteration. Uh, the bottom bracket is a touch lower. Uh, when when we release this, fully release this, uh, it'll have an upper link on there that puts it a little bit closer to stock. So it'll it'll be pretty similar to uh, to what it was before. Uh, Sweet man, so check out the website. How long before you think these are available? Um, we're getting them scheduled on on our machines at the moment. Um, depending on how long what we have going on right now takes, which you know is, can be hit and miss. Um, I'd give it two months, about. Uh, yeah, okay. and Anno is another thing we can drag on. Uh, you know, sometimes Anno takes forever to turn around. So. For sure. But, but yeah, I mean, the, both of these programs have been run, you know, as if they were, both the CNC programs for the upper and lower link have been run as if they are production. Um, so it's it's going to be quick to, to get them on. And you guys make links for what other brands? I know there's a slew of them, but... Uh, I, I used to be able to rattle them I know, off. just top uh, of your head, the most popular. <laughs> off the top of my head, Santa Cruz, uh, Specialized, Transition, um, Yeti, Evil, Kona, Norco. Um, let's see, do a giant rain link. Um, just did Cannondale Jekyll. Uh, I know I'm forgetting... Wants. Yeah, no worries. And if they want to find you, it's just CascadeComponents.com, right? Uh, CascadeComponents.bike. Dot bike. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, and then, yeah, we're uh, up in Everett, Washington. Anything within the States is free shipping. Um, machine everything in-house. Uh, yeah. Sweet. Thanks, man. I appreciate all your help on this. And, uh, yeah, guys, just uh, take a look at their website. they got some really cool stuff. Thanks again, Jimmy. I appreciate it. Yeah, thank you for, uh, for letting us test with stuff with yeah, your bike. Yeah, of course, man. Thank you.